What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to Post Mouse. Oh, look, I'm not dying. Yes, how are you guys? Hopefully, you guys are having a really great day today. Listen, we got to go back. We're back being the adorable mouse we are. Hmm. Where do we go? Okay. That's just gonna see. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> what do you mean, dude? Okay. Oh. There we go. We're we're ascending. About time too. All right. I'm pretty sure this is where we left off last time. I just want to show you guys some, right? Check this out, right? I was like, cause like, you know, whenever I start a video, I usually like do something like this, you know, with an audio cue or something like that, just to like get my voice synced and everything. But I was looking at the stamps and look at this, bros. They actually have story behind it. They have lore behind it. So I will read some of this as soon as I'm done with the uh, with the delivery, right? Hmm. I still want to know what happened here, but you know. With only with us playing the game, we will find out soon enough. Okay, so we gotta we gotta ascend even further up. Just just ascend further up. There we go. But yes, oh, dang it. Yeah, so hopefully you guys are having a really good one, man. It's super cold right now, dude. It's like where I live. Supposedly at night it was gonna be like 28 or something. Do I believe it? Perhaps. I mean, hey, we've been in worse situations, and by worse, uh oh, hey, I didn't run. And by worse situations, I'm talking about like you know the heat, bro. The heat being like a hundred and something, bro. And at night, being like eighty or something. Man, that sucks, dude. <sighs> Unfortunately, I don't have. Oh no. Okay, come on, man. I don't have um a heater and even if I did I don't think my mom would want to put it on because you know bills are expensive nowadays man if you see your your gas bill right now it's like up the roof dude like people who paid like if you pay $30 per gas for gas you're paying like 60 now or something like, like it doubled or something like that so you know hey man don't fall, homie. Don't fall. Dude. We're mice, bro. We're mice. Are we mice? Or we're a mouse? My bad. We're a mouse. Mice are the white rats. We are cute little gray mice. Where do we go? I thought we would go through here, but no. I mean, maybe we do. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up, because, okay, kind of, can I drop it? That is not how I wanted to drop it. Okay. Interact. Hold up. This is tiny? <laughs> That's a tiny one. Oh, we can pick it up at least. Oh. <laughs> Yo, dude, okay, okay. Maybe um, drop it from right here. Drop. Okay, so what does this do initially? Oh, okay. That brings this one up. Here. Okay. Okay. I thought for like a second, you know, I had to like drop it, try to make it through, you know, thread the needle, <laughs> but no, it wasn't the case. Great. The objective. Hold up. Okay. I thought there would be some stamps behind that, but no. Okay, so now we are in dangerous waters here because everything is moving and we are really tiny, so anything can kill us. Oi. Oh, <laughs> this sucks a lot. Go, go. All right, we're, we're, we're grooving. 
We're grooving. We're just gonna let this do the its job and rotate us towards where we have to go. Okay. All right. There we go. That's it. No. Wow, look at the view, dude. Look at the view. This is a very small town, but hold up. There's gotta be a reason why we came this way. You think there's gonna be a stamp over here? Oh, crud, 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 crud. Hmm. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Hey, look, there's something down there. Okay. All right. Hello, hello, yo, yo, oh my gosh, okay. Oh man, okay. Uh, the only reason why I come, I'm coming back is because of that. Why is this right here? Do we have to bring this up? I mean, oh look, I see another stamp. Okay, hold on, hold up. Everything. No, 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 no. Everything stops. Let me see. Let me see. I think I have to get the stamp from up there. Because I don't see another way that we can go to, like, the pillars. So maybe this. Maybe me blocking this place actually like you know stop the thing outside from moving maybe stop the thing outside from moving like erratically right so let's go take a look i was wrong it stopped down there okay so then it has to move no matter what the, uh, the, the, the hands of the, the hands of the clock has to move even though if they're broken, can I see the, uh, okay. I think I can. Aha. Okay. Okay. I had a feeling, bro. I had a feeling. I'm like, wait a minute. If I could see outside from the inside, um, I could probably, you know, finesse this right here. And, um, you know, like that, you see? <gasps> My lord. Okay. Okay. That scared me. Okay, so no objective. I get the feeling the clients are just around the corner, just a bit further. Hmm. Maybe. Damn, look at that, man. Look at that. Okay. Bro, I'm telling you, man, if their budget was a lot higher than this, I'm pretty sure they could make a really great looking game, bros. Even better, even better looking than some of the AAA titles, dude. 100%. Okay, so this is how we're going to get the, the stamp. So we might as well try to get it right now. Because I don't think that we can collect these stamps like we can't come back and collect the stamps so we might as well collect it now give me give me all right so after this uh this little quest you know we'll uh we'll read the stamps that we have right now and uh we'll, we'll expand our knowledge as to you know what's going on right here Okay, so we have to go up. My brother, please. That's the wrong way to go up. There we go. Okay, going up like that. I don't see another stamp, so. Wait a minute. Behind the wall? Hmm. <laughs> because sometimes, sometimes they could be tricky. You're like, hey. They don't, they're just going to go on forward. They ain't going to 
you know, turned around and, um, you know, August, August, August. So the mama bird gave worms to the younger birds. And then there was somebody else too. There's something behind that rock. All right. So I guess we have to, we can deliver the, uh, the mail. He's even further up. That's fine. Okay. I saw the nest, but I lost my footing. Oh, look at that. Hello. Hey, is that a mouse? That's a mouse. Well, what's a mouse doing all the way up here? Wait, didn't mom say mice are dangerous? You're thinking of rats. Hey, I think it's looking at us. Oh, uh, hey, stranger danger, stay back. Yeah, you're gonna be sorry, Ma, when mom gets back, you rat. I have a letter for you. It's from Miss Amber. Miss Amber? That's mom. Mom? Mom. Chirp. Mom. Mama. Say, Mr. Postmouse, our mom isn't here to read us the letter. Do you think you could uh, read it to us? Uh, sure, I can. <clears throat> to my little chicks, I hope you're eating and staying warm together. Mommy has been trying to get Ruby some help from a doctor, but it's going to take a bit longer than I expected. When you grow up, I hope you will be you will be nicer than some of the ra uh, robins I've met in the city. Though it's not all gloom here. I met Dr. Hawthorne just outside of the town. He's a very smart and kind city robin and has promised to help our Ruby very soon. Just hold on a bit longer and don't leave the nest until your feathers get back. There's some extra grub under the nest if you need it. Stay fluffy and warm. Love, Mom. Oh, so Mom's okay. I hope uh, that's a good doctor for Ruby's sake. I really miss her. Thank you, Mr. Postman. Sorry for calling you scary rat. <laughs> You're way nicer. I know you've I know you will grow wing big wings someday, just like us. So you won't have to climb that tower anymore. So are you going back to the post office now? Actually, yes, because I think that's it. Have a good trip. Thank you, dude. Oh, oh looks like the boss is out. Hmm, I should head home, but is that a letter on the desk? Well, I've already delivered two. It will be such a shame if I kept another family of birds waiting here uh, to hear from loved ones. Or maybe it's an elderly hedgehog waiting to hear from her grandchild. I better take it. It's address to Irene. Hmm, I should go ask around to find where she lives. All right. Well, uh, we are, um, you know, we are very weird in 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 the in the act of post office because you know all right postman the boss isn't around he went early to pick up uh, his prescription though we all know where uh he's just going to fly catch with robbery okay uh what about the robins how are they doing they seem energetic but also scared i think the letter managed to calm them down wow when I woke up today, I did not expect post mouse of all mice. Yeah, you see, told you we are mice to be traveling all over the woods to deliver letters. So watch up, uh, watch up to just run the last errand before heading home. Is that a letter I spot? Let me have a look. Miss Faraday. Haven't heard of this one before, but the address is somewhere in the underground ruins. If I were you, I look for a light source. I'll consider it. Thank you for your advice. Okay, so it's. It's under, under, okay. Okay, so let me, uh, let's read some of this. There are several accounts of the name Faraday engraved in different locations of this, uh, of this large structure, also known as the Great Ruins. Perhaps there are the, the these are the names of the giants told in legends a lot, long before the settlement of Yellow Woods. Oh, look at that. Yellowwoods likes Yellowwoods likes to promote and inspire artists from across the land. We are proud. Uh, we are proud to have a community of artists who share the beautiful landscapes of their lands. All right. 
Okay, few have visited this place. It has a quiet sorrow that makes folks uncomfortable standing in there for too long. The giants who lived there were neither strangers or to struggle, sorrow, nor sickness. Best to leave this place to rest with the giant. Oh, so we were in that whole clock tower pretty I'm guessing it turned into like a hospital stay. Uh, many who study the great stone structures parse that this is perhaps an illustration of what the family of giants may have looked like in the great ruins. To many communities, a discovery like this is very controversial. Some elders claim to have seen giants and say that this is proof of their existence. Others say it's an elaborate hoax to perpetuate fear in their community. Well, I mean, they're not too far off the thing. I mean, that's how they look. Uh, Miss Amber is a hard-working mother of four. She has a loving reputation in the Yellow Woods community, keeping watch over our homes from the tallest perk. We love our local Robin family. Okay, so she, Mrs. Robin, or Amber, pretty much takes care of us from on top. That's cool. This is pretty cool. Our local community of mice from the Yellow Woods has shared their appreciation of our postal service by dressing up as post mice. The charming way to celebrate the hard work and dedication of the Yellow Woods Post Service. That's it. Uh, okay. Interesting. Very interesting. Where do we go now? Um, all right. Let's go that way. Thanks, homie. I'm out of here. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> My guy, please just go up, dude. Look, go this way. Let go. Okay. Do you have a light? Okay, no. We have to go that way. Do you have a light? What is I see? Both on the side of past curfew? How unusual. I don't like I don't live at home anymore. I don't have a curfew. No, but I figured someone like you, whoever breaks the rules, will stick to it anyway. Don't you also have a curfew? I'm just packing up a final ingredient for the sextuplet birthday feast i'll be out of your fur before you know it do consider coming home from part but for the party mom really might just get our siblings to kidnap you if you don't hmm. i am looking for a light my guy or my uh, i think she's my sister she's our sister i'm looking for a light bro let's go that way Just over the little thing, right? Oh, just over the little thing. So I did notice. Oh, look, it's um Pablo, right? No, 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 no. Yes, it's definitely Pablo. Oh, let me see. Uh, the boss wasn't at the office. They left another letter for me. I'm just gonna take care of this one quickly before heading home now. Uh, where to find Miss Faraday? All right. Hey, Pablo, do you by any chance have a light? Little post mouse, you are out late, aren't you? Are you not? Just got one more delivery to make, and then I'm, I'll be done for today. One more delivery. Hmm. It is very dark out. Can you even read in this light? Uh, I'll work something out. I still owe you a favor. If you recall, I just so happen to have a firefly in a jar. Not very rare, but difficult to get a hold of. You would give me something so valuable? <laughs> if that letter you carry is anywhere near as important as the one you brought me i will happily help you let me free a firefly for you it shall it shall light the way thank you mr pablo thanks pablo you you the best dude oh yeah baby we are we are good to go all right so where do we go now so i'm guessing we have to follow the light yeah. All right, let's, let's fire the fire. Let's follow the firefly. I'm pretty sure it will lead me to where we have to go. But yeah, so I was reading that this game is nothing but like an hour long. So maybe we can finish it here, right? I mean, I am playing on PC, so I do have more of a Leo layaway. Oh, hold up, firefly. There is yet another stamp. Does anything concern you, post mice? Post? No, nothing in particular. Nothing at all. I'm not fearless, if that is what you're asking. 
uh concerns are good for small things like us but sometimes there's there comes a point where concerns turn into roadblocks the way you are searching for is like that should i be concerned don't worry about it all right i'm not gonna worry about it i just want to collect I'll collect can i collect okay never mind. okay well uh, don't concern yourself bagworm um you know everything will be all right uh, we have to put a we have to put a note on on that uh on that uh the stamp because i can't get it all right all right one more letter what i don't want to say it i was gonna say what can possibly go wrong yes Okay, okay. Here we go. Um, oh, let's sign it. This place is dark. Maybe coming here was a mistake, but no. I started this task. Now I have to see it through. I have to find Mrs. Faraday. Mm hmm. Well, the uh, firefly all of a sudden left me. Well, you know, for good reason. I understand it completely. You have to go that way, right? very ominous very ominous level compared to like the cheerful day that we had you know i got a feeling that there's gonna be rats bro like you know what i'm talking about like the, you know what i'm talking about like those, those big fat rats bro. 100 uh this place is dark okay mrs faraday please so please how much you guys want to bet it's gonna be a rat too dude Mrs. Faraday is going to be a rat. It's a cat, dude. No. Turn around, post mouse. Oh, the bird. <gasps> Yo, I know what happened to the post, the post pigeon. Shift. Oh, did I die? I suck, dude. This is a this is a quick event, man. So this is what happened to the pigeons, dude. Damn. So there is no fair Miss Faraday or whatever. It's maybe there is, and it's just a cat, right? But I'm pretty sure there's no Meriday Mer Faraday or whatever her name is. What do you mean? I shifted. Okay, there we go. I figured out how to do it. Um. I'm using a controller now, suckers. So here we go. So you, what you have to do, <gasps> not get stuck like that. No, oh my gosh. All right, so what you have to do is press down, dude. So press down instead of up, because if you press up, you're gonna go towards the cat. And if you're playing with the mouse and keyboard, you have to, pr you have to press shift and S at the same time. How am I gonna? Okay, but yeah. So now that we know how to do it, man. This. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I'm pretty sure that the post pigeon is dead. Hundred percent. The pigeon is dead, bros. How? Where do we go? What? Oh no. My 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 nose is itchy now. So I guess I have to stay at the bottom. Stay here, maybe. Okay. Exit climb. Okay. 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 Oh man, this was all a setup, dude. 100% a setup by the cat. Okay, okay. Uh, there was a checkpoint. I was gonna be like, dang, that dumb cat. I have to run back and do it. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, go, 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 go. Oh, 
man, this sucks so much eggs. I'm dead. Okay, so there are checkpoints, dude. The, the developers of this game knew, dude. My brother in arms, bro. Hey, dumb cat, look around. Cat, I'm out of here, dude. I'm out of here, dude. What? Okay, there we go. That was gonna say, man. That was a clean getaway, dude. Oh, I messed up. Bro, I have to say that the camera needs to back up a little bit right here, dude. Look at this. I can barely see. Oh gosh, there we go. Miss Fra oh Faraday, dude, it's right there. Miss Faraday. Yeah. Dear Irene, Irene. It's been a while, hasn't it? Mom's been muttering your name a lot in her sleep, but she Dang it, I thought it would be responding to her brother's letter. I really hope you don't hate me still. And mom, I really am ashamed of something uh, since I said to you. Things just been, it hasn't been the same since you left. I want you to know that the dance is moving out of the south of the Yellow Woods. If you're around, maybe stop by. Love, your big sis. Someone sent a letter to me? Yes, and it sounds like they care a lot. You're a brave little mouse. You may go. You can leave the letter here. And thank you. There we go, dude. So thank you guys for coming. I really appreciate it. Follow support on Instagram, Mr. Gaming. Oh. Subscribe, like, comment down below. Become part of Mr. Gaming, Inc., Mr. Gaming Incorporated. Thank God our morning we're live because if it wasn't for him, we would have been in the first place. Have faith in him and faith in him because everything's going to be all right. Trust me, Pablo. And everyone, please have a good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Bro, the, our boss, man. Well, there we go, dude. Post mouse, dude. It. Ah, oh, man. Thanks for playing. Yo, thanks for making that game, man. It's, it's It was a pretty good experience, bro. Pretty good experience. All right, like I said, it was a pretty good experience up until the end, but I'll tell you this right now, though. Um, okay, one, right? The game and the atmosphere is just amazing, man. It's, it feels alone, right? Like, for, for this to be the Yellow Woods, there isn't a lot of NPCs running around, you feel me? So it, it, it all feels alone. I understand the um, the the clock tower being alone, right? Because nobody wants to really step in there because of the things that happen. Um, and the underground, you know, I, I understand it completely. But outside in the woods, it just feels alone, man. But, you know, like I said, they had to do what they had to do with the budget they had. One, two. Um, the controllers were okay up until I started using the controller. And then, then when I started using the controller, everything just seemed to be very slippery, right? Uh, what happens if I put continue? Let me see. Nope. Uh-uh. I thought it was going to be like, okay, you know, you can roam around, you know, collect the stamps that you missed. But no, we can't go back to the stamps. We have to get the stamps while we play the game. That's fine. Um, but yeah, so once you start using the, <laughs> the controller, I'm sorry about that. Uh, then you start to realize that, like, you know, it's super slip. Ugh, I just bit my tongue. It's super slippery. And, um, you know, you just got, you have to make it work somehow. But, you know, hey, like I said, with the budget and them only being a couple students, props to them. Dude, I really did enjoy this game. Um, maybe by collecting all the stamps, you can get a little bit of the lore. But, you know... I wouldn't hold my breath 
because there's only a couple stamps, so, you know. Uh, and probably, maybe in their Steam page, it's where you have, like, you know, there's more detail as to what happened to this world. Who knows? Who really knows? Um, would I want to see something like this in the future? Yeah, man. These type of games are amazing, man. It's because, okay, look, listen. You ready for this? You guys are not going to like what I'm going to say, but are you guys ready for this? People who make these type of games aren't blinded by the money they may think they're going to get. You feel me? Take a look at uh, Square Enix, right? A big, big um, game company. Uh, what happened? What happened when they took out Balan's Wonderland or Wonderworld or whatever it was called, bro? It flopped the second it hit stores because they were blinded, bro. <coughs> character design wise you know i guess it was okay because you know square enix they work with the likes of final fantasy kingdom Hearts, and all that stuff but that's about it you know like when you talk about square enix you talk about final fantasy or you maybe you talk about um kingdom hearts right let's say capcom resident evil uh street fighters uh, and some of like the old old good ones and stuff like that, you know? Uh, Game Freak, right? Pokemon and stuff like that. But all these big name companies, they get blinded by the money, bro. They, they, get, they get blinded by the greed. So they don't really pay attention to what comes out of their butts, dude. So they just like poop out game after game every year. But then you have people like these. People who actually care about what they make right even if it's just a small budget or even if they didn't have a budget to begin with bro it's a free-to-play game dude and yet to me it grabbed my attention to the point where i wanted to finish the game and and now i'm i want more right i want to know what happened in this world why did the humans or the giants they um vanished where are they now how did the how did the animals become sentient, right? All these questions just come to mind when I play a game, a game like Post Mouse. Whereas, you know, Final Fantasy, you go like, oh, hey, man, what game is this now? 20? 30? I stopped counting back at like 100. Like, they're trying to squeeze out a story, but they're blinded by their own greed. Like and, and like I said when I first played this game, you know, if by any miracle, if by any chance someone out there gives these people a chance to either remake the game or expand the game, don't lose focus from what you did to what you're going to do in the future, you know, expand your world, expand post mouse or redo the game, you know tweak tweak things or something like that right but don't lose your focus don't get blinded by the greed make a game that you will be proud of even if it's a free-to-play game even if the game costs a dollar or two that's my that's my philosophy of the day see you guys in the next one peace out everybody i can't um <coughs> i can't you know really squeal right uh because then i'll start coughing but i'm feeling a lot better yesterday i would f say i would feel like 90 percent. i'm like at 93 95 percent. i'm getting better bro i'm getting better it's just that this weather dude it's so cold all of a sudden man when i went out to uh to the post office to uh deliver the mail right to deliver um a sticker that someone ordered from me dude man it was just old man oh lord but hey it is what it is it's winter and you know it would only we would only get better all right guys that's it video's over have fun stay safe and i'll see you guys tomorrow with whatever is on steam or whatever i have in my computer <laughs>